Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh dan salam sejahtera. Selamat datang ke Syahnun Channel Saluran Pendidikan Anda. Apa khabar semua? Diharapkan semuanya berada dalam keadaan sihat dan diberikan rezeki yang berlimpah ruah oleh Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala. Tajuk video pada hari ini ialah Orbital Overlap and Hybridization. Mari kita saksikan. Welcome back to Shahnan Channel. Our topic today is orbital overlap and hybridization. We need to know the meaning of hybridization. Okay. First, uh, this is the meaning of hybridization. Mixing of two or more atomic orbital in an item to generate a new set of orbitals. And the number of hybrid orbitals is equal to the number of pure atomic orbitals used in the hybridization process. For example, uh, mixing of uh, S orbital and P orbital, and then it will become hybrid of SP. Okay. Then the number of SP hybrid orbital is also two, equal to the S and P. Covalent bond are formed by overlap of hybrid orbital with atomic orbitals and overlap of hybrid orbital with other hybrid orbital. Okay, table here is the relationship between the Lewis structure, the Vespers model, and hybrid of central atom. All right, we look at the uh, Lewis structure of. Uh, Beryllium chloride. Okay, this is Lewis structure. The chlorine should uh, has uh, three lone pair. Okay, like this. Okay, this is Lewis structure. For the Vesper model, BeCl2. The symbol is Ax2, and uh, the shape is linear, and angle is 180 degree. Okay, we look at hybrid of central atom. Central atom is beryllium. The hybrid is sp. Okay, combination of s orbital and p orbital become sp, and we have two sp orbital arrange themselves, and the shape also linear. Okay, we look at aluminum chloride. Aluminum chloride. This is the structure with a lone pair on uh, chlorine atoms okay the Vespers theory the symbol is AX3 the shape is trigonal plana and the angle is 120 degree all right and this is a hybrid of central atom aluminium 3sp2 combination or mixing of s orbital p orbital and p orbital and uh, for carbon tetrachloride and here is the Vespers theory degree is 109.5 AX4 tetrahedral mixing of 1S and 3P become SP3 the shape is tetrahedral and we go to the phosphorus pentachloride Vespers theory the angle is 90 degree and 120 degree Symbol is AX5 and shape is trigonal by pyramidal. All right, we look at the uh, central atom phosphorus. 1S and 3P and 1D become SP3. All right, and the last one is uh, SF6, AX6 octahedral. All the angle is 90 degree and combination or mixings of 1S, 3P and 2D become SP3D2. All right. Now we go to the questions. Describe the hybridization process and draw the orbital overlapping of ammonia NH3. This is Lewis structure. This is what we have to do first. Write Lewis structure. And then we count the bonding pair. Three bonding pair, one lone pair, 
and electron domain is 4 so 4 electron domain means basic shape is tetrahedral and AX3E that means the final shape is trigonal bipyramidal and look at nitrogen as a center the hybrid of nitrogen is sp3 right the sp3 will refer to the basic shape okay and then uh, we want to know the hybridization process first we write the ground state of nitrogen it has five valence electron and then we write the excited state of nitrogen same as ground state why we look at the Lewis structure nitrogen has one lone pair and three elect electron for sharing with three hydrogen atoms we already know that nitrogen will choose sp3 hybrid orbital so we mix one s orbital and three p orbital to form sp3 hybrid orbital here we have a pair of electrons same as lone pair on nitrogen and three single electron ready for overlapping with three orbital of hydrogen atom okay now is the time to draw the orbital overlapping between the central atom of nitrogen and terminal atoms of hydrogen first draw the 4 sp3 hybridized orbital of nitrogen with tetrahedral arrangement don't forget to write the sp3 on each hybrid orbital write a pair of electron on one of the sp3 hybrid orbitals the other three hybrid orbital of sp3 got one electron and overlap it with s orbital of hydrogen then write the symbol of sigma on that overlapping Each hydrogen atom use one S orbital for overlapping. The shape of ammonia is trigonal pyramidal because it has three bonding pairs and one lone pair. Here come the explanation. Three sp3 hybridized orbitals of nitrogen atoms overlap end to end with S orbital of three hydrogen atoms to form three sigma bonds one sp3 hybridized orbital of nitrogen is occupied by lone pair electron all right the second question is describe the hybridization process and draw the orbital overlapping of pcl5 so this is the structure of pcl5 five morning pair zero lone pair electron domain is trigonal bipyramidal and the shape also trigonal bipyramidal hybrid is sp3d we write the valence electron of phosphorus with empty 3d orbital why because from restructure we know that the molecule of pcl5 is expanded octet total electrons around the phosphorus atom is 10 more than 8 that means phosphorus atom contribute 5 electrons for sharing with 5 atoms of chlorine so one electron from 3s orbital of phosphorus excited to empty 3d orbital the sp3d hybrid orbital form when 1s orbitals mix with 3p orbital and 1d orbitals lastly don't forget to draw the valence electron of chlorine atom let's draw the orbital overlapping Firstly, we draw the sp3d hybrid orbital of phosphorus with trigonal bipyramidal arrangement. Make sure all hybrid orbital are labeled with sp3d. Then draw the p orbital of chlorine overlap end to end with sp3d hybrid orbital of phosphorus don't forget to label 3p orbital on p orbital of chlorine
and then we use arrow to represent electrons lastly five six more bond on the overlapping explanation five sp 3 d hybridized orbital of phosphorus overlap end to end with p orbitals of five chlorine atom form five sigma bonds Okay, the third question is describe the hybridization process and draw the orbital overlapping of carbon dioxide. Alright, this is Lewis structure of carbon dioxide. It has two bonding pair and zero lone pair. And the basic shape and the final shape is linear. Remember that double bond is considered as one domain electron. Hybrid orbital of carbon is sp. As we know that carbon has four valence electrons, so we draw the ground state of carbon. At excited state, one electron from S orbital is excited to P orbital. How do we know? Okay, refer to the Lewis structure. Carbon atom has four covalent bonds, meaning that carbon atom has four single electrons for sharing. As we know that the hybrid orbital of carbon in carbon dioxide is sp. We got two electrons in sp hybrid orbital and two electrons in unhybrid 2p orbitals. Electron in unhybrid orbital is prepared to overlap with electron of oxygen to form pi bond, whereas electron in sp hybrid orbital of carbon is prepared for sigma bond. Look at single bond on oxygen, one for sigma bond, one for pi bond. Okay, now we want to draw the uh, orbital of lapping. First, we draw the sp hybridized orbital of carbon and label it sp and sp. Alright, don't forget to draw the unhybrid 2p orbital of carbon the orbital must be perpendicular to the sp hybrid orbitals to make it clear sp hybridized orbital at x axis the other two unhybrid 2p orbital at y and z axis and then we draw the overlapping of sp hybrid orbital of carbon with 2p orbital of two oxygen atoms don't forget to label the 2p orbital of oxygen sigma bond and also the electrons okay now i want to show you how to draw the overlapping that form pi bond first draw 2p orbital of oxygen at y axis and it is overlap side to side with unhybrid 2p orbital of carbon label it as a pi bond the two electrons that involve in this overlapping must be at opposite spin then draw the 2p orbital of oxygen at z axis and it is overlap side to side with unhybrid 2p orbital of carbon okay label it as pi bond now we have two pi bonds already okay the last one is explanation two sp hybridized orbital of carbon atom overlap end to end with p orbital of two oxygen atom from two sigma bonds two unhybridized p orbital of carbon overlap side to side with p orbital of two oxygen atom to form two pi bond that's all for today thanks for watching